Um, hello YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to make a server because mine is outdated so I might as well restart it. So you need to go to minecraft.net, the original place, then you go to download so it's like there's that buy now thing, play the demo, and then play minecraft download. So download. Then go to multiplayer server, and then minecraftserver.exe. So, you're going to want to show in folder so that you can get that guy alone. So, then you can back out of here and just my virus detector. And then you need to make us make a file. You can name it whatever I want. I just like to make it MC server. So, I know that's my Minecraft server. So, then you drag and drop it into there. Then you need to go into here and then just run it and then there should be a some files that will appear right here in a second so it's it's preparing it so just wait for this to be done so right now it's basically generating your world that you will be using Alright, 46, 47. So this might, well, my whole computer. Well. Alright, I'm not sure if you saw any of that, but I just got a big black screen. So, it's done. You don't need to care about this warning. Everybody gets it. So, it's just like, can't keep up. Did the system time change or did the server overload? So, basically says that for most everybody that I know. So, then you can just, the safe way to stop your server is just typing stop right there. And it'll save the chunks and everything. Alright, so... That's why you wanted to put it in a file, or else all those files will be scattered around, or they won't come, I believe. So, um, you don't need to care about any of these, but you don't need to care about the world, but banned IPs. So, it'll just tell you what to do. So, victim name, say I wanted to ban Bob it's on 12... 2112 and then Caleb 55565 banned by banned until banned until 6000 reason for being a jerk so Bob will not even be able to sign on so it'll just go to Bob's computer and Bob won't be able to go on my um and Bob's computer won't even be able to connect Alright, so, don't save. So, I'm just going to make sure it's all the same. Alright, there we go. So, banned players. Well, basically, the same thing. So, you could ban people. So, ops, this is what you want to do. So, you want to be an OP, so, write your name in there. So, OPing is basically... So, you're the admin of the server in other ways. So, just write your, just write your, um, name in that, and save. And if it doesn't open in, it should be a text document. Yeah, it should be a text document. But if it doesn't open in Notepad for some reason, you go, you right-click it, open with Notepad. And then it should work. So, server... You don't need to care about that. So this is the real server, the properties file that you want to know. So it'll have everything. So allow the nether true. So if you don't want people going to the nether, just fal false. But I want people to be able to go to the nether, so true. Level name, you don't need to care. Na enable flight, false, server port. So leave all of this the same. Up until rate here so spawn in pcs if you don't want a villager just do false 
But I want villagers. If you want a whitelist, like, if you only want certain people to be on, then do a whitelist, and then you'd have to put their name under this whitelist. So that's that's what a whitelist is. Spawn animals. If you don't want any animals, do false. I don't know what that is. Hardcore. It, it, it explains itself. Online mode. True. Just keep this always true. Because if it's false, then a hacker could find his way on and hack your modem. So PvP, true, that's player versus player. If I didn't want you to kill each other, then I'd do false. But I honestly don't care. So difficulty. If I do 500, it is going to be really hard to stay alive. Your guys' hunger bar is going to be dropping. There's going to be monsters everywhere. So it's going to be really hard. But I only like it on 2. So game mode 0, that's basically survival. One is creative. I think two. I'm not sure. I wouldn't do two. But I think that two is adventure mode. But I I don't know that. So max players, if you want five million people to be able to play on your server, then do that. But I only want 25 because if there's more, the more max players, the laggier it is. So view distance, keep that the same. If not, your server will crash every time. And then MOTD. Um, when, when they, um, go into add server, some servers say, like, free build under it, and some just say a Minecraft server. MOTD is basically that, so I'll do hello and welcome to my server. So, yeah. So then you want to make sure you save all these. So save. You don't need a. You don't need to do whitelist unless you're unless you did a whitelist true. Then you just do all of these. All these are names you want. So that's all you want right here. Um, what you can do right now is run your server and then go to Minecraft and you can log into it without port forwarding it. Um, only you can though. So if you're so if you're only making this because you don't want to, because you don't want to do like single player commands, then just stop right here. But, uh, but, um, so, oh my sir. <sighs> just play. All right. Minecraft is not responding. But basically, I will show you this. Uh, my server's on. So, if you just wanted to do single player commands or just do do it so that you could set the time, the day, and everything, then. Oh, whoops. Try again. I forgot to put in my password. Whoa, what the heck? Alright. So, it'll load, then you just go to multiplayer, direct contact, and then um, local host. So I'll just leave that up there for a few seconds so that you can copy it down. Alright, so that should be good. And then just to make sure your server starts. So, this is your world, and if you're not happy with it, then you just reset it. So where you initially spawn is not the spawn point. You need to kill yourself. Ouch, looks like that hurt. <laughs> so now this is the spawn point. So I'm just going to make myself go into creative mode. Game mode 1. So this is the block you spawn on, so I'm just going to make it a diamond block. It's lagging because it's never ran before. Um, but it won't lag as much when I got it. So, this is where you spawn after you've killed yourself.